Welcome to JTEC Australia's presentation on Vigor IP PBX2820 configuration. In this video we will show you how to record the user prompts for the IP PBX. These prompts are used by the auto attendant to handle incoming calls. The main user prompts required are prompt 5 used for office hour welcome message, prompt 6 for non-office hours welcome message, prompt 7 for general message. We will demonstrate two methods to enter the user prompts. These are using an analog phone connected to the phone port of the router, then use the IVR menu prompts to record the message. The other method is to record an audio wave file using your computer and then use the IPPBX prompt maintenance utility to load the file into the IPPBX. We will now demonstrate the first method. The flowchart shown here illustrates the steps to record the user prompts. You will need to press the required buttons to, to record the message. We will now show you how to record prompt 5 for the office hours welcome message. First we connect the analog phone to the FXS port on the bigger IP PBX2820. Then we dial star 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 to access the IVR system. Then after hearing the prompt dial 1155 hash to start recording uh, prompt 5. The last digit corresponds to the prompt number. Then we record our message and when you finish you press hash when you finish speaking and then press 1 to save. Now I will demonstrate it for you. Welcome to Traitic Australia. To save the message, press 1. To review the message, press 2. To re record the message, press 3. To exit, press star. IVR configuration. Please input a valid value followed by the hash key or hang up to exit. Now we will look at the second method to enter the user prompt into the IP PBX. The first step is to record an audio WAV file on your computer and should be in the file format as shown here. For user prompt 5, the file name to use is as shown here. We now go to the IP PBX system prompt maintenance configuration menu. Now click on Browse to select the file you require. In this case we'll select Prompt 5 and click Open. Now click on Restore and the file will now be uploaded to the IP PBX. The completed message will be displayed when the Prompt file has been successfully uploaded. If you require further information on Draytech products please contact Playtech Australia. Thanks for watching and hope to catch up with you in our next episode.